Hey, welcome back to Gina's Beauty Room. So today I'm going to be filming a full face of nothing new. And I'm also going to be featuring this product. I haven't tried this, so we'll see how this works. So this is from Insert Name here. They kindly sent this to me. And it is a 18-inch ponytail wrap. So it's 102 grams of hair. And I got it in the in the shade uh, dark brown, and this is in the style alley. So, of course, um, I think you may have heard if you're uh, if you like to browse YouTube and stuff, and like a lot of beauty um, influencers and beauty YouTubers, I think that you'll be aware with of what insert name here is, and yeah, it's just like an online extent hair extension shop, you know, so. I like the way that it says no bad hair days. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, because sometimes, a lot of times, I'm like blabbering on and on about this, but a lot of times I don't want to fix my hair. So I think that this will be like a great, quick and easy alternative, you know? So I'm anxious to try this. And this one, the alley is only like a wavy one, but they have like a lot of other kinds of ponytails, different shades and lengths and thicknesses as far as grams and stuff um, is concerned but yes we are going to try this out I'm excited so I'm going to put that over there and I did already take out all the products they're all in front of me of just stuff that I had in my stash and let's just go ahead and get started okay so first I'm going to start out with these products so this is the L'Oreal Magic Lumi and then this one is the Pore Blur blur and prime primer from revolution so we'll go ahead and let's go in with this one first and then this one will be more in my t-zone So as you can see, I'm pressing this into the skin all along my T-zone area. So next we're going to go in with, it, with this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the finish matte because they do have a natural finish, a dewy finish, and then a matte finish. So I love the natural and the dewy too so um since i put this one this lumi i'm gonna go ahead and go with the matte just so it can kind of balance things out Okay, so next I'm going to go in with this Color Clay CC Under Eye Corrector. And I have them in both shades. The only two shades that they have. And we're going to mix the both of them under my eyes. Me 
So how are you guys doing today? Hopefully you're doing fine. And if you like these kinds of videos, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I would really, really appreciate it and subscribe if you haven't already. So next we're gonna go in with this Milani Conceal Imperfect and the Maybelline Fit Me in the shade 11 Vanilla. I like to mix shades a lot. <laughs> For a little bit extra coverage, I'm going to just dot one little dot of this Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. That's it. This is my Cody Airspun. We're gonna dust everything off. For a little extra coverage, I'm just gonna go ahead and put this Rimmel Stay Matte in the shade 011. We're going to go in with this LA Color Contour little palette I got at the Dollar Tree with the mini NARS Eda brush.
More highlight. For brows, I'm going to go with this Studio Pro from BH Cosmetics along with this Rimmel London. This is the Pixie Eyebrow Gel in the shade Golden Glaze. And this just kind of gives it a little highlight. Okay, we're going to move right along to the Lorac Gold Palette. This one has been in my stash for a long time, but I want to test out to see how well it performs still.
Okay, we're going to go in a little bit deeper. I'm going to get this black shade and this palette.
now we're moving on to Milani in the shade 26 Nude. And then this one is in the shade 40 Naturally. This is from Clinique. Okay, so now we're gonna try this alley uh, from insert name here, ponytail rep. So, and it's 18 inches long, so let's go ahead and do that now. Let's see how this is going to work. Oh my gosh, okay. So, see, so it has like, different they have like different ponytails you see that different shades so this is how it'll look before and after which is what i'm going to show you now and then there also is like they sell hair tools so the blow dryer the brush heat brush and then the barrel okay so let's see well before i take this out Oh, wow, this looks good, the shade. Okay, let's go ahead and let me get a brush. Hold on. Okay, so I got these items here, which is the Boar's Hair Brush, the comb, and the ponytail. Okay, so... So let's see how this is going to look. Okay, so I do want a higher ponytail. So, oh, I'm really stretching my face out. All right, so I'm assuming that, yeah, I'm supposed to put this in a ponytail first. And before I tighten up my ponytail, let me put these down. And then this one. Okay, so now let's do the ponytail. Okay, so this is how the before looks. And then we're gonna go in. So this is the ponytail before. So I'm assuming I'm supposed to wrap this around. Let me see. Okay, so we'll take it out of here. Let 
look how shiny already it is and look how what a good match because what you do is you send in the picture of your hair color and then they match you um, from their website. So it does have like a Velcro. So you can see that. So it's a Velcro. It does have this there. And then, okay, that's their brand. So very pretty. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? So I got 18 inches. I don't know if you can leave your hair like that. And then put it, we'll try it like that. That way it can look like I have even more hair. But this is very full though. You see that? And I love like the natural wave to it. Okay, so <laughs> let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah. And don't mind my scar. I do have a scar there. <laughs> okay, so. So we are going to go put it just like this. Hopefully it's not distracting, but okay. So we're going to go in here, right? Let's see. Let me turn. Okay. So I put it. Okay. Let me start all over. So high ponytail. This is going to go on the top. And clip in. Just like that. And then we're going to wrap around this let's see we're gonna go wrap it around because it's velcroed remember so let's see so keep wrapping it Ooh, I'm liking it already. And just keep wrapping it. And then you just get your this and put it. Do I even need to? Like, yeah. In the back. There we go, you guys. Look how pretty it is. It's like here so there is the final look wow i really really like it they matched my hair like perfectly oh my gosh that is so so cool this is like so easy oh my gosh wow I am loving, here, let me see if I can, here's the profile, see that, here. <laughs> I don't know if I'm like in frame, but here is the profile, and then here is the back, let me see if I can, so here is the back, hopefully I'm getting the shot, Yes. Oh my gosh. This is so pretty. See that? Then here is this side. I mean, it's going to look the same on all sides. And then here is how it looks here. Let me see. I keep moving a lot. So let's say your hair came to the front. You guys, I am loving this. This is so, so pretty. Wow. It's so fun, easy, effortless. Like, I am loving it. So easy to use. Oh my gosh, you can wash it. Oh my gosh. Is this like a... Can you heat style these? Okay, so this is... Let me see. Let me read this. So it says mid length with beachy waves, 18 inches, alley dark brown. It says, oh, oh, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So you take this off. This is an even extra. 
Oh, okay, so before you wear it, do you test this out first? Let me see. It says turnover for in you guys, I am loving this. So this one's in the shade dark brown, if y'all are wondering. So it says uh, slide the chrome underneath. So yeah, I, I don't know if it's like heat safe, you know what I mean? But of, I don't think you want to even mess with it. it. So if you order this alley one, so like I said, it's in the shade dark brown. You wouldn't need it. You're ordering the wave. You know what I mean? So it does have a natural wave to it. And then this one, I don't know if this is just a, uh, I'll leave their website down below in case y'all want to order one. I guess this is like an extra Velcro if you need, or I don't know if this is like a color match and then it, so you won't use this. They put this in here at the top. You know what I mean? So try not to use the ponytail in case you want to return it. Use this instead to see if it's a good color match. And then you go from there. But you guys, I am loving this. This is so, so pretty. What do y'all think about this ponytail? Would y'all order one? Yeah, I will link their shop down below. Check them out. I think they're so cool. I've heard a lot of things about them, but I've never tried it for myself so this is like so exciting for days when I'm like on like third day hair day and not being washed and I want to put my hair up in a ponytail and then you know you go from there but anyways you guys so this is the final look featuring this alley ponytail from insert name here I am loving it I hope you love this makeup look and hair little tutorial um, if you did give it a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe for more Get Ready With Me's, more beauty content on this channel, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys.